hope shattered. The moment terror engulfed Kharkiv, the air was thick with the warmth of a fading summer afternoon. Laughter echoed through the bustling square, a symphony of life and normalcy in a city scarred by conflict. Children chased pigeons, their innocent joy a stark contrast to the ever-present tension that lingered in the air. Then, in a horrifying instant, everything changed. A deafening roar ripped through the heart of Kharkiv, the ground trembling beneath their feet as a monstrous explosion tore through the air. A wave of heat and pressure swept through the square, transforming the mundane into a scene of unimaginable chaos. The laughter died in an instant, replaced by screams of terror and the gut-wrenching crunch of collapsing concrete. Dust and debris filled the air, a suffocating shroud that blotted out the sun and plunged the world into an eerie darkness. The once vibrant heart of Kharkiv had been transformed into a scene of unspeakable carnage. The air, heavy with the smell of smoke and dust, was punctuated by the piercing cries of the injured. Dazed survivors, their faces streaked with soot and blood, stumbled through the wreckage, desperate to escape the nightmare that had engulfed them. The world seemed to spin, a macabre carousel of destruction and despair. In the blink of an eye, the familiar rhythm of life had been shattered, replaced by the chilling symphony of war. Amidst the rubble stories of loss and survival, in the aftermath of the blast, amidst the twisted metal and shattered glass, stories of loss and resilience began to emerge. Each piece of rubble, each blood-stained photograph, whispered a tale of lives tragically altered. There was the young couple, their dreams of a future together buried under the weight of fallen concrete. The elderly woman, her frail hand clutching a single photograph, her eyes reflecting the unbearable pain of losing everything. A young musician, his fingers once dancing across the keys of a piano, now lay still, his melody forever silenced. A teacher, her heart filled with the promise of nurturing young minds, now lay buried beneath the debris of her shattered classroom. Each story, a poignant reminder of the human cost of this senseless war. And yet, even in the face of such unimaginable loss, the indomitable spirit of humanity flickered. First responders, their faces grim with determination, worked tirelessly to pull survivors from the wreckage, their every move a testament to their unwavering courage. Volunteers, their hearts heavy with grief, offered comfort to the injured, their compassion a beacon of hope in the darkness. The resilience of the human spirit, though tested, had not been extinguished. It flickered defiantly amidst the ruins, a testament to the strength that lies within us all, even in the face of unimaginable tragedy. For in the ashes of destruction, hope, like a fragile flower, still dared to bloom. The Director A silent guardian amidst the ruins, Sergei Petrovich, the director of the shopping center, stood frozen amidst the chaos, his eyes wide with disbelief. The familiar sounds of laughter and chatter had been replaced by the deafening roar of the explosion and the heart-wrenching screams of the injured. The once vibrant heart of his beloved shopping center, a place of community and connection, was now a scene of unimaginable devastation. His mind raced, trying to comprehend the magnitude of the tragedy that had unfolded before his eyes. Just moments ago, he had been greeting shoppers, sharing smiles and stories, the rhythm of life humming along as it always had. Now, the air was thick with dust and the stench of burning debris, the silence punctuated by the anguished cries of survivors. His initial shock quickly gave way to a steely resolve. There were people trapped, injured, scared. He had to act, had to do something, anything to help. Pushing aside his own fear and grief, he joined the first responders, his hands trembling as he helped to pull away debris, his voice hoarse as he called out to those trapped beneath the rubble. Each cough, each whimper, fueled his determination. He wouldn't allow himself to crumble, not while there was still a chance to save lives, to offer comfort, to be a beacon of hope amidst the despair. In the face of unspeakable tragedy, Sergei Petrovich discovered a reservoir of strength he never knew he possessed, a testament to the unwavering spirit of humanity in the face of adversity. Section 4. A Family Torn, Picking Up the Pieces of a Shattered Life the Ivanenko family had been strolling through the square, their laughter echoing through the warm afternoon air, when the world exploded around them. Little Anya, her eyes wide with wonder, had been pointing at a colorful display of balloons, her tiny hand tucked securely in her father's. Her older brother Dmitri had been teasing her, his laughter a melody that brought a smile to their mother's lips. Then, in a heartbeat, everything changed. 
the deafening roar, the blinding flash, the searing pain. When the dust settled, the once vibrant square was a scene of unimaginable devastation. Anya lay trapped beneath a pile of debris, her tiny body racked with sobs of pain and terror. Dimitri, his arm twisted at an unnatural angle, screamed for his mother, his voice hoarse with fear. Their parents, their bodies battered and bruised, frantically clawed at the rubble, their hearts pounding with a mixture of terror and desperate hope. Each agonizing minute stretched into an eternity as they struggled to free their children, their cries for help swallowed by the chaos that surrounded them. The Ivanenko family, once a picture of happiness and love, had been torn apart in an instant, their lives forever scarred by the indiscriminate cruelty of war. Their story, a heartbreaking reminder of the innocents lost and the futures shattered in the blink of an eye. Section 5. Echoes of Unity A community rallies in the face of tragedy. As darkness descended upon Kharkiv, casting long shadows over the wreckage, a spirit of unity and resilience began to emerge from the ashes. Word of the attack spread like wildfire, igniting a wave of compassion and support that transcended borders and languages. From the smoldering ruins of the square, a testament to the strength of the human spirit arose. Volunteers flocked to the site, their faces etched with concern, their hands eager to help. Doctors and nurses worked tirelessly, their faces illuminated by the flickering lights of generators, their dedication unwavering as they tended to the injured. Strangers shared water and food, their acts of kindness a beacon of hope amidst the despair. The community, bound together by grief and a shared determination to rebuild, transformed their collective sorrow into a powerful force for good. Donations poured in from neighboring towns and distant countries, a testament to the empathy that unites us all in the face of tragedy. The spirit of Kharkiv, though wounded, refused to be broken. From the ashes of destruction, a renewed sense of purpose emerged. A powerful reminder that even in the darkest of times, hope, like a phoenix, can rise again. Section 6. The Unending Nightmare. A city, a nation, forever scarred. The Kharkiv attack, a chilling reminder of the ongoing conflict that has gripped Ukraine, stands as a stark illustration of the devastating impact of war on innocent lives. It is a tragedy etched in the heart of a city, a nation, and a world grappling with the consequences of violence and aggression. The physical wounds will heal, the rubble cleared, but the scars of that fateful day will forever remain. The echoes of the explosion, the heart-wrenching cries of the injured, the sight of shattered lives, these are the ghosts that will continue to haunt the streets of Kharkiv, a constant reminder of the fragility of peace and the enduring cost of conflict. The city, once a vibrant hub of culture and commerce, now bears the weight of this tragedy, its spirit forever marked by the events of that day. Yet, even amidst the grief and despair, there is a glimmer of hope. The resilience of the human spirit, the unwavering determination to rebuild, and the outpouring of support from around the world offer a glimmer of light in these dark times. The people of Kharkiv, though forever changed, have shown the world the true meaning of courage, compassion, and unity. The Kharkiv tragedy is a stark reminder that the pursuit of peace and the protection of innocent lives must remain at the forefront of our collective consciousness. It is a call to action, a plea for empathy, and a reminder that the consequences of war extend far beyond the battlefield, leaving an enduring legacy of pain and loss that will reverberate for generations to come.